The problems we were experiencing in 2013, our environment would be in decision stream, delivering to a SQL Server environment, we were just running out of capacity. Our delivery times were starting to exceed what the users needed. We support a global enterprise with locations in Europe, Australia, New Zealand, China, and there's expectations of data deliveries being done and we were starting to exceed those. By July of 2014, we decided to do a reset and that's where we decided we were going to use data stage from the information server platform to deliver to Netiza. But looking at the switch to use data stage to take and deliver to Netiza, we went to our IBM business rep and I asked for three different references of companies that could help us in this endeavor. We chose Prolifix to be the company to work with most because their depth of knowledge around that information server stack. We felt they had the experience and the knowledge to help us to get where we wanted to go. One of the things Prolifix has to offer is a very deep onshore set of technical architects as well as a very deep offshore development laboratory. Part of any engagement with a new client is understanding not only the technical requirements of what the client needs, it's also the personalities that are involved as well. So we needed to understand the personalities within JLG and Oshkosh and align the right personalities that could work with the customer themselves, as well as be able to effectively manage an offshore team. The decision to take and choose the information server platform was looking out into the future of what we needed to be in terms of the center of excellence across all of Oshkosh. The information server stack would take and provide us with data governance, it would provide us with lineage and a number of other tool sets that we needed to be that center of excellence across all of Oshkosh. Having picked Prolifics, we sat down and we brainstormed ideas how to resurrect the project to get over to NetEase and what were the right steps. We decided on a two-phased approach. The first approach was to use the CDC tool in order to move the data from SQL Server over to NetEase on a daily basis so our analytics team could convert the cubes and reports over to running off of NetEase and they could convert their migration over to the data center. And then we followed that up with the second phase which was converting the ETL using data stage over to the NetEase platform.